Jacoby Tarbox Bubble Trap, the High Trap, is offered with a variety of end connections and styles. Some features are common amongst all of the designs, however. Taking from the bottom of vessels where you have multiple tapers to create a more efficient drain, we've incorporated an in and outward angle intersecting so we easily drain the bottom of the bubble trap. This was done because the high trap has a centralized input. Having a centralized input means that liquid is equidistant from the wall in all areas. This allows for more efficient and accelerated bubble dispersion inside the bubble trap and potentially decreasing residence time. As it goes out the drain, another unique feature of the drain is that the transition never want to be sharp because it can hold up material. The easiest manufacturing technique would be to provide a chamfer, effectively creating two sharp edges instead of one. How is this better? It's not. So what we've done is incorporated a radius. Now you've got a smooth transition from the bottom of the high trap down into the drain with no edge for hanging up material, making it a superior design. Additionally, the high trap includes captured threads on the top, a tapered head to allow full draining from the outside as you keep your trap clean. The brackets are included so that you can have one or two. One could be used for mounting. Bubble traps are not light and having them be held just by surrounding tubing on your skid can compromise the integrity of the tubing system. So we've included a standard mounting bracket for mounting the device itself. A second one is available so that you can mount individual point sensors so you can have remote reading for high and low levels on your bubble trap. We are showing you, just for capability reasons, multiple connections on both top and bottom, as well as turning inlet and out. Standard would be to have a straight connection on the bottom in two locations and one vent. Adding additional instrumentation is also very easy on the high trap. You could add a guided wave radar, for example, including a T so that you can have a vent out the side and mount a guided wave radar straight through the device is a common variation we see from many of our customers to, again, minimize the number of connections on the high trap itself, as well as providing maximum flexibility. The guided wave radar is something that could be added aftermarket or from Jacoby Tire Box Hygienics as well.